Here are your Drexel Athletics top 10 plays of the year. Starting off at number 10, Crew four-peated at the Dadvale Regatta, winning the overall points title thanks to two gold medals and five silvers. Their celebration was so big, it almost sunk the dock. At nine, softball's Bailey Reeves started off April 10th's game with Towson with a leadoff home run, the first of her career. She followed that up with the 100th hit of her career in the third inning. She's the 34th Dragon to reach the 100 hit club. Number eight, two Drexel swimmers won events at the CAA Championships. Joel Berryman, whose teammates call him Kiwi, won the 100 freestyle, while Minion enthusiast Rachel Bernhardt took home gold in the 200 breast. At number seven, CAA Rookie of the Year Vanessa Kara scored the most clutch of her program record 11 goals on the year, putting this goal in the back of the net against Elon in double overtime on October 18th. At six, it's the blonde bombshell himself, Michael Kay, who won the game in overtime for men's lacrosse down at Delaware with this snipe, keeping their playoff hopes alive. Goal, number 40, Michael Come into the University of Delaware and take down the Hens by a score of six to five. Now for the top five plays of the year, as voted on by Drexel Athletics staff. At five, Tavon Allen hustled back in transition and absolutely rejects this William and Mary layup attempt, but he wasn't done. He got up, sprinted down the court, and drilled this three-pointer in a road win for men's basketball. The one in, the three at the other, and by Tavon Allen. You do the rest. At four, Lauren Gary didn't waste any time as overtime began in a women's lacrosse game at Columbia, taking the opening draw control herself and scoring the game winner. Austin Rose got the match-winning pin versus Ryder. I'll let Nick Grinups and Steve Winfield take it from here. Oh, that's two! That's two on the edge with 10 seconds left, and the fall oh, the Dragons! The Dragons come away with a win here! I am dumbfounded. Austin Rose, what a match. Congratulations to the Drexel Dragons taking a 21-14 win over big rival Ryder. Two, Jess McCarthy slid into this rebound and lofted a perfectly placed shot right over the top right corner of the net. A goal which proved to be the game winner for field hockey as they defeated number 14 Delaware to qualify for the CAA playoffs. Before we get to the play of the year, let's take a quick look back at plays 10 through 2. Step five, Tavon. And your 2015-16 Drexel Athletics Play of the Year is... Colin McGlynn's goal against Penn. In front of a record crowd at Vitus Field, Francisco De Palma found McGlynn for this header in men's soccer's 1-0 win in the University City Derby. 